is becoming a dynasty over at DC Everest. The girls' soccer team, they've locked up at least a share of the WVC title for a third year in a row. And now they have a chance to take it outright Thursday night against Wausau West. 11 seniors have paved the way to a perfect conference record with just one game remaining. At 14-2 overall, the Evergreens, they've earned the top seed in the D1 postseason tournament. Much in part due to their well-balanced attack on the offensive, returning the WVC Player of the Year in Grace Sandquist, along with the squad leading point scorer Jenna Bauman, who both suffered torn ACLs last season. So while back in the box, McKenna Campman has been an iron curtain leading the conference, saving over 85% of her shots sent her way. So now they're at full strength in the trees. They're buying into the mindset because it takes a forest to flourish. I think the big thing that we have to continue doing is our positive attitude. Um, this is like my second family, honestly. That closeness that we have, that we always have fun at practices. You can see a lot of laughing back there. We had a lot of unknowns going into the season here, uh, especially with uh, two players like Jenna Bauman and Grace Sanquist uh, coming off ACL injuries, not sure when, not sure when they were going to get back. And um, you know, we were fortunate to get them both cleared by early April. And, uh, but it's been a, a, a slow process trying to get them uh, mixed in with the team and just getting that chemistry, but I think we're there now. I think we all click very well together because we've been playing with each other from like such a young age. So our chemistry is there and it's definitely gotten stronger through the season. The top seeded Evergreens, they're going to host 8 seed Chippewa Falls for the first round of the playoffs next Tuesday, May 28th.